What is up everybody and welcome back to Masters of the Forge. Today we are finally completing the legendary crafter quest. Yes! Oh my god, it has been such a struggle. It it's like it's a struggle beyond all struggles. If as you may have noticed, like this is a very slight change. You may have noticed my graphics are slightly better. I have not gotten a new computer, no. But I the graphics detail have always been on high. But I switched them off of high and then back on to high, and my graphics detail changed a bunch. So, like, now my graphics are, like, a lot better. I don't know what happened. They were on high, and then I switched them off and then back on. See, like, the boots, you can tell, like, the graphics are better. Look, look at the back of the cape. I don't know. It's just, like, you can tell the graphics are a lot better. But as you can see, I'm in the Shadow Palace, hanging with Moros, the Shadow Tree, Bartleby's evil brother, sort of. Sort of Bartleby. He, like, in the storyline of Morganth, uh, when Morganth tries to kind of re replace Merle as, like, th like, she's trying to, like, rule the spiral, this guy, she would have him replace Bartleby. You end up killing him, but he's, like, still here. I don't know. I don't know how that works. But let's go ahead and go craft a spear collar drum. Making sure I have everything I need. All my slots are ready. Um, let me see if I have my red house equipped. Yep. Alright, let's go. It was a very slight change when I updated my graphics, but um, like the the main thing that I like, kind of like upgraded was my was my clothing, and like I don't really th see anything else like was kind of changed. Might be slight more of a lag now, but I don't know. Graphics are amazing, you know. Gotta make a sacrifice. <sighs> my pet is getting closer to uh, Mega. It'll be actually my first pet uh, train to Mega. It's at 806 out of 2000, which is fairly good. I mean, I haven't done much training of it. Uh, oh, wait, yeah, I got I got transmute first. Um, Where is it? Transmute fossil. All right. This might take a little bit. That's three. That's four. That's five. And last one. Six. Yes. Alright. I'm so excited for this. This has been like the hardest crafting quest in a. Wait, wait, I gotta check my backpack. Okay, so. I already have one of the conga drums. I just need to make another. Making sure I don't do anything wrong. Here we go. Yes! Oh my gosh. Alright, talk to Ko Koyeti Ghostman. Alright, let me see where that is. I'm so slow with going through my quest right now. Oh, what's that? Oh. I'm sorry, guys. I should have said on this quest when I finished. What the heck? Okay, I passed it, and I just don't know. I just didn't know. Uh, oh, there it is. I didn't think that was that. Okay. Let's go ahead and head up there. Oh, these graphics, though. I was going nuts when I upgraded it. I was talking with Blaze. Um. Uh, I just. Yeah, I was talking with Blaze earlier, and then I updated the graphics, and I was going insane. <sighs> so, actually, I will not be crafting any spells anytime soon. Um. As I probably talked about in my, um, in my gear setup video, that will be, um. If it isn't already out, it'll be out soon. But um, probably is already out. Um, 
uh, in that video I uh, spoke about how I will probably not be crafting any spells because farming lore master is just a lot easier and um because crafting spells is so hard it's it is insane how hard crafting spells is like you need the hardest part like most most of it's just easy um hardest part about it is crafting the um um, is crafting the treasure cards, which is a struggle by itself, but after you get through it, it like it doesn't feel like much. The hardest part is getting the sunstone, because when you are crafting, uh, when you are crafting a spell, um, they cost uh, 50 sunstone each, depending on uh, the spell you want to craft. Um, uh, but I will be crafting some uh, crafted robes and hats, and I will be crafting some. Uh, wands to just transmog because most of the a lot of the crafted wands look very cool. Um, what else was I gonna show you guys? Um, I guess that's it. Let's go talk to him. Turn this in. This is fine work. I am pleased to call you a legendary artisan. May you continue to make such items of beauty. Oh <gasps> yes! Jumbo, young wizard. A voice on the wind told me you are ready to learn something new. Visit me Legendary in the artisan, market. I gotta put that on. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Legendary artisan, let me uh, change that. Legendary artisan. I am legendary. Okay, so uh, let's get the other quest from him, and then uh, wait. Let me turn that off. Okay. Jumbo, young wizard, your skills as a crafter have improved, no? If you would go further, you must go to long lost Azteca. There is a crafter there whose fame has reached even this far out on the spiral. One named Ostomeka the Weaver. If you know this one, find him and speak to him of crafting. Tell him that you are ready to learn. All right, let's go talk to Ostomeka. Um, actually, someone actually told me I might actually be able to do this crafting quest. Um, in this video because uh, I heard it's it's actually very easy. Um, this is one of the easiest crafting quests, the Azteca one. The Chrysalis one is actually, uh, I heard, is harder than this one, but only slightly. Um, the legendary one, <clears throat> uh, legendary crafting quest is, um, by far the hardest crafting quest there is. Um, so this one I, the, we, will be a lot easier. Um, and if I can't, my friend actually gives to me a, uh, no, that's not it. Um, a crafting elixir from, uh, Belize crafted me that, I mean, uh, that gifted me that, so... If I need to use it, I will. I have two slots open, so I should be okay. <sighs> Dying Azteca. Poor Azteca. Azteca was so awesome. Azteca was like my favorite world. Out of, out of all the Morgan theme, all, of all the worlds um, with uh, relating to Morgan, Azteca was my favorite. Azteca was just. It was amazing. To Mecca, must craft you something before we all die. If you guys hear that singing, which you probably do, um, uh, someone actually told me that um, that that singing right there is actually Morgan singing the song of creation or whatever. And I was like, wow, she's actually a pretty good singer for like you know, evil lady. Okay, I thought I got pulled to that battle when I got stuck. Huh. Ooh. <gasps> What's this? Hey. Ah, you have come seeking knowledge. I have. Hear me when I say that the way of the crafter is the highest of callings. More so than even magic. That's impossible. That, mu that, that has to be impossible. There's no higher calling than being a wizard. It requires the utmost dedication, will, 
highest perception as well as the soul of an artist. If you wish to improve your skill as a crafter, make for me an eagle war shield. A powerful symbol of Aztecan culture. I can sell you the recipe if you wish. Then you will have to find the ingredients yourself. Agave nectar you can find in the mangrove marsh. The other items you must find on your own. Return to me with the eagle war shield once you have finished it. Demonstrate your skill to me. Oh, so he wants me to find out where I can get, um... Uh, whatchamacallit, um the stuff. So as to Eagle War Shield. Yes please. Okay. Backpack. Um let me see. What do I have to do with this? Potent Trap TC. Okay. Um raw TC. Alright then. Gave leaves, Gave nectar, scrap iron, golden pearl, leather straps, turquoise. See, look, I have like everything already. I already have everything I need, except for the leather straps, which I probably sold. Um. Ah, oh, darn that potent trap TC though. I thought I could actually uh, craft that. I was actually looking at potent trap TCs last night because I was uh, thinking about this um, this quest, and um. <clears throat> And uh, apparently they're dropped by like every boss in Azteca, but I really don't want to farm for it right now. I'm gonna see if I can just go find one at a shop. I love this music, it's so awesome. This was this is the music on Chiboba. And it's like it's like it's like uh like race against time music, you know. I don't know. It's really it's really awesome. The Chinimpa Gardens oh, let me grab that. It's so foggy. Jeez. Chinimpa Gardens. Oh, he's got a quest for me. Hello. Would you like to see them? You will find the Thunderhorn zombie Whatever. shambling about oh. near the tombs. Please retrieve the jeweled beak of Zam Toucans. Oh, there it is. The Chinimpa Gardens. You find some agave. Oh, okay. So. Okay, so they're just telling you that's what agave looks like. Alright. Um, I think that's the only thing you need to craft, though. So, as you can see, I have mostly everything. So, uh, I'm gonna go. I'm going to check in the bazaar if they have anything for me. So as you can hear in my house, I have that same uh, music scroll. Turquoise actually is one of the hardest reagents to obtain, but since I already have a lot of it, and I don't know why I have a lot of it, but, um, so I already have 21. Sometimes, if you see it in the bazaar, just buy it. Don't even think about buying it. I mean, like, don't even, like, wonder, eh, should I buy it or should I not? Just, just buy it. It doesn't even matter if you need it or not. It, it just... Don't don't even think about don't even like wonder whether you should buy it or not. Just buy it because it's, it, you'll need it in the future. And when you're searching for it in the bazaar and it's not there, well, you're gonna have a problem. Oh wow! Bunch of people, maybe a bunch of pets with uh, you no know, people around them. 
Oh, it's probably because I just upgraded my updated my uh, graphics or whatever. Okay, I'm gonna sell something. I think I have something for into that, that I can sell. Oh yeah, that. Uh, sell that as well. Um, let me see. Uh, I need leather straps. Okay. Leather straps. Oh. Okay, I need ten. Well, that was easy. Uh, okay, I need raw TC. That was really easy. Alright, so obviously they don't have it there, so I'm not going to be able to do two episodes in one video. So, uh, when, so there was me almost crafting the Azteca War Shield or whatever it is. Um, very easy crafting quest. Very, very easy. Um, uh, after I craft, um, after I craft the, um, the War Shield, I will be crafting it as Azteca, um, I don't really know what to call it, but it's like, it's a, um, it, it looks like this, I'll show you guys. It looks like, uh, where is it? It looks like this, right, this. It looks like this, only it is black and red and looks really boss. Um, and it would really match my outfit, and I'm going to craft that and probably, uh, transmog it to this wand right here. Um, because I love the look of this wand, it's just, it's such an awesome little sword. But, um, I think I'm going to transmog it to the Azteca one. I don't know. Uh, this one's more of a battle weapon, and the other one's just more of a blade. So, I will see you guys next time, and it was 101. Peace.